This uh, Fruit Lovers is a lemon catli guava that I ground layered. So what I did was I took off, you see there, took off some of the bark and um, buried it under the ground. Doesn't seem to have grown where that bark was taken off. It sent out some roots, chopped it away from the mother plant. Now, look, it's got loads of fruit coming here too. Now I'll put it in the ground, in, in a pot and it will grow into a new tree. That, two reasons. One, it was a very low lying branch, which you might want to trim off anyway. And two, uh, instead of throwing it away, turn it into a new plant, right? The only thing I've got to do is I've got to treat this. It's got some white fly coming on it. I'll treat that, squish them off and then just uh, put some neem on there or something. Soapy water would be fine. And uh, that side looks nicer, doesn't it? <laughs> but you've got to look underneath. And that's another thing. Don't just spray on top of your leaves. if you, Because bugs pretty much live under the leaves. All right, there we go. Better get potting. See you later. There she is. All potted up nicely. Ready for it. Look at that. There's a bug on there already. Get over there. A stink bug. Oh, my goodness. Darn things. Always look at that. See that? Squeeze them, they stink. Anyway, um, very easy to grow these uh, lemon catlic guava. Pretty, they've got a bit of cold tolerance compared to other guava. Um, cold, flood, dry. Pretty, pretty easy to grow, I'd say. And they have delicious fruit. I think the fruit tastes like a, like a lemon cake. Um, so give it a go. Uh, very easy. Is try it with a with a branch that you don't really want, and uh, you might be surprised and get yourself an extra tree. But this one's going to a new home tomorrow. Uh, it's going to be a surprise Christmas present for someone. Oh, little winter solstice present. All right. Thanks for watching. Bye.